everybody, this is Rebecca and I'm Gael and we will present you BBC News! Well, today is the 22nd of April and it is the Earth Day and we prepared a special program for you. First of all, we will talk about the different disasters occurred recently. And secondly, we'll have the expert's opinion on this. We will have the reporter in Mauritius where we had an earthquake this morning. And also the horrible cyclone which occurred this week. And now the weather forecast! Okay, so now the weather forecast. So, the north will be particularly sunny today, with uh, sun in over Grand Bay, Pamplemousse and Port Louis, with temperatures varies from 32 degrees to 35 degrees. So, weather very sunny and very hot in the north. However, on the central part and the southwestern part, it will be very cloudy, rainy, and thunderstorms in Kyopip, with te temperatures varying from 16 degrees to 30 degrees. However, on the airport and over the south and the southeast, we don't have any data. <laughs> so the wind will come from the south east up to the southwest. Thank you, Santosh. So now we have a alarming breaking news from Kyopip in Mauritius. And our reporter Vincent is at the place. Yes, uh, I'm actually in Mauritius uh, where we had a terrible big earthquake this morning. People are panicking, people are dying right here. It's terrible. I was just frantic. Here we can, we can see dead bodies behind me and the road, uh, on the road because Mauritians do not have places to put them. The Prime Minister said this morning, three hours after the earthquake, that he will do all that he can do to reduce the damages, but the Mauritian population is still waiting for help. We need help, we need international help right now. Vincent Duverger, BBC News. Thank you, Vincent, for the report. And finally, Darren will interview Sean Yu, an expert about earthquake from the Meteorological Institute of Vakwa. So, hi everyone. I'm actually here with the expert Sean Yu. Can you tell me what happened, please? So, we have recorded uh, an earthquake of magnitude uh, 6. Um, all my staff are actually keeping a prudent eye on all the machines because we are waiting for expected uh, repeated earthquakes and there will be probably a tsunami in the next hours. And what can we expect in the future to help the people? And uh, I would like to remember to all the victims of the earthquake that uh, several shelters have been organized to welcome them. And um, I'm also demanding to all the country in the world to help us because the situation here is really serious. Thank you. Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs> This was the special edition of the Earth Day 2011. Thank you for watching BBC News.